everyone in this video we'll discuss about the applications of stack the first application of stack is evaluation of arithmetic expressions first of all what is arithmetic expression an expression that only contain arithmetic operands and operators is called an arithmetic expression the results of these expressions are always in numeric values Arithmetic expression can be written in three different notations in fixed notation prefix notation and postfix notation in prefix notation the operator is written before the operand in an expression on the other hand in postfix notation the operator is written after the operand like a b plus and in infix notation the operator is placed between the operands infix notation we write expression in infix notation for example a minus b plus c where operators are used in between operand in infix notation the operator is between two operands for example x plus y where x and y are arithmetic operands and plus is a operator we can even use parentheses in arithmetic expression prefix notation in this notation the operator is prefixed to the operand that is operator is written ahead of operand for example plus ab this is equivalent to its infix notation a plus b and prefix notation is also known as polish notation for example we have a expression like a plus b plus c this expression is in infix notation how to convert this expression into prefix first of all convert a plus b into prefix plus ab then plus c now assume that plus ab is equivalent to s1 now s1 plus c convert s1 plus c into prefix then a result is plus s1c now put the value of s1 value of s1 is plus ab plus plus abc is a prefix of a plus b plus c then postfix notation this type of notation is known as A reverse polish notation in this notation style the operator is postfix to the operand that is the operator is written after the operand for example ab plus this is equivalent to the infix notation a plus b for example we have a infix notation a plus b plus c now how to convert this infix to postfix first of all convert a plus b into postfix then a result is ab plus then plus c assume that ab plus is equivalent to s1 now s1 plus c now convert s1 plus c into postfix then a result is s1 c plus now put the value of s1 s1 is ab plus ab plus c plus is the postfix notation of a plus b plus c a plus b is in infix notation and prefix notation is plus ab in prefix notation operator symbol is placed before the operand and in postfix notation operator symbol is placed after the operand a plus b into c 
first of all convert a plus b into prefix then a result is plus a b multiply by c then assume that plus a b is equivalent to s1 s1 into c now convert s1 into c to prefix then a result is star s1 c then put the value of s1 star value of s1 is plus a b c now if you want to convert a plus b into c to postfix then a b plus multiply by c assume that a b plus is equivalent to s1 s1 into c then convert s1 into c to postfix s1 c star then put the value of s1 a b plus c star is a postfix notation of a plus b into c next is the algorithm to evaluate a postfix notation we have a postfix expression apply this algorithm for the evaluation of this postfix notation the first step of this algorithm is add a right parenthesis at the end of the postfix expression then the second step is scan every character of the postfix expression and repeat step 3 and 4 until right parenthesis is encountered the step 3 is if an operand is encountered push it on a stack 5 is operand if operand is encountered push it into a stack then 6 is also operand if an operand is encountered push it on a stack then 2 if an operand is encountered push it on to the stack then plus plus is not operand if an operator is encountered plus is a operator then pop the top two element from the stack as a and b and evaluate b plus a where a is the topmost element and b is the element below a the 2 plus 6 result is a we have to evaluate to topmost element of this stack then push the result of evaluation on this stack then next is multiplication if an operator is encountered again multiplication is an operator then pop the two topmost element from the stack as a and b evaluate b multiply a where a is the topmost element and b is the element below a So five into eight result is forty. Next is twelve. Twelve is an operand. If an operand is encountered, push it on this tab. Then four. Four is also an operand. If an operand is encountered, push it onto this tab. then slash slash is an operator for division if an operator is encountered then pop the two top element from this tag as a and b and evaluate b divide by a two top most elements are 12 and 4 12 divided by 4 result is 3 push the result of evaluation on this tag then next is minus minus is an operator if an operator is encountered then 
pop the two top element from this pack as a and b and evaluate b minus a and push the result of evaluation on this tab 40 minus 3 result is 37 then a right parenthesis is there if an operand is encountered push it on this tab parenthesis is not a operand if an operator is encountered then pop the two top element from this tab so parenthesis is not a operator then control transfer to this step 4. Set result equal to the topmost element of this step. Result is 37. Then step 2. Scan every character of the postfix expression and repeat step 3 and 4 until a right parenthesis is encountered. Now right parenthesis is encountered. Then control transfer to the step 5. That is exit. This is a complete algorithm to evaluate a postfix expression. Next is the algorithm for evaluation of a prefix expression. In prefix expression, operator symbol is placed before the operand. This is the algorithm for evaluation of a prefix expression. First of all, accept the prefix expression. Then step 2, repeat until all the characters in the prefix expression have been scanned. Scan the prefix expression from right, one character at a time. First character is 12. If the scanned character is an operand, push it on the operand step. 12 is an operand, push it on the step. Then 4. 4 is an operand, push it into the stack. Then slash, slash is an operator for division. If an scanned character is an operand, pop two values from the stack, apply the operator on the popped operand and push the result on the operand stack. 12 divided by 4, result is 3. Then 8, 8 is an operand. If a scanned character is an operand, push it on the operand step. Then star. Star is an operator for multiplication. If the scanned character is an operator, then pop two values from the operand stack. Apply the operator on the popped operand and push the result on the operand stack. 3 into a 24. Then 7. 7 is an operand. If an operand is encountered, push it on the operand stack. Then 2. 2 is an operand. If operand is encountered, push it into the stack. Then minus. Minus is an operator. If the scanned character is an operator, pop two values from the operand stack. Apply the operator on the popped operand and push the result on the operand stack. 7 minus 2, 5. Then plus, plus is an operator. If an operator is encountered, pop two values from the operand stack. Apply the operator on the popped operand and push the result on the operand stack. 24 plus 5, 29. 29 is the final output after evaluation this prefix expression. In next video, we'll discuss about conversion of infix to postfix.